66 million years ago, our planet was forever changed by a cataclysmic event. The impact of a massive asteroid striking with unimaginable force near what is now the Yucatan Peninsula. In an instant, the world was plunged into chaos. The immediate aftermath was apocalyptic. Shockwaves rippled outward, incinerating everything in their path, while colossal tsunamis battered coastlines and Itutik earthquakes shattered continents. As red-hot debris rained down from the sky, firestorms swept across the globe, blanketing the earth with soot and ash. The sun's light was choked off, plunging the planet into a prolonged darkness, a nuclear winter. Photosynthesis ground to a halt and food chains collapsed. The lush forests that once teemed with life were decimated, and with them, countless species vanished. Nearly 75% of all life, including every non-avian dinosaur, pterosaurs, and large marine reptiles, disappeared forever. Oceans, too, were not spared. Tiny plankton, the very foundation of marine food webs, suffered devastating losses rippling through the entire ecosystem. Yet, amid this devastation, some life endured. Those able to burrow, scavenge, or adapt to varied diets, small mammals, resilient birds, crocodiles, and certain fish, survived in the shadows of a transformed world. Ground-dwelling birds with sturdy legs outlasted their tree-dwelling relatives as forests fell. With the dominant dinosaurs gone, the world was filled with empty niches. Nature abhors a vacuum, and so began an extraordinary chapter in Earth's history. Mammals, once small and nocturnal, began to diversify and grow, evolving rapidly to fill roles left vacant. Early giants, like the pantodonts, roamed the recovering landscapes. Birds, too, flourished, branching out into the ancestors of the diverse species we see today. Ecosystems slowly rebuilt. Some marine life bounced back within centuries, while other systems took millions of years to regain their former diversity. Out of immense loss, life found a way, ushering in the Cenozoic era, the age of mammals, and setting the stage for the world as we know it.